new music from Katy Perry, 102.7 Kiss FM. And the timing, well, I mean, Tubbs the engineer, the timing of bringing her in the last 42 seconds of Daisies was pretty remarkable. That's a best, yeah. best of show for you. Uh, I've never been this early in my life, and you know that, Ryan. Uh, uh, Katie is, uh, she likes to run 22 minutes late, but I don't think it's always your fault. I think there are things that happen between when uh, you, you're going to get there and then the things you're told by the time we go on the air. But So you look fantastic. Is that, is that your hair? I'm not wearing any pants. Is that your hair? Nice. Yes, it's my, it's my hair. Um, it's... I didn't brush my teeth. How about that? Nobody mm. knows so, or cares. Mm. <laughs> mm. Um, I had this, um, I had a dream okay. that my first Zoom call link was a link sent by my neighbors to me saying, Katie, wake up, Katie, wake up. And I was like, why are my neighbors waking me up on a Zoom call? I hate you. <laughs> This is what happens when you get up early. Your neighbors, your creepy neighbors, mm -hmm. whisper in your ear softly like that. And it's very scary. <laughs> Hi, guys. How are you? Are we answering that question? <laughs> <laughs> um, listen, so, Katie, uh, are you, last time you were on with us, you were from, in your car. I assume you've now you created this little uh, soundproof booth in your home. Uh, yeah, kind of. I'm not going to, like, turn the camera around. No, you don't have to turn the camera around stuff but basically my setup is like this it looks it's a ring light i've got my laptop nice. on top of a, <laughs> a box set of the beatles very fancy um, nice. All I'm yes. with that, you know if, if well this is going to end at some point i don't know about soon a la three more months um but uh when i when i move into another house or i go to a new house or get a new house in the future i'm going to have a ryan seacrest set up i'm oh. like I'm not <laughs> it's you've done it you get it you have you are the prepper of all preppers i bow down to you. <laughs> you, you you know i was always prepared for something i've been watching 60 minute stories for 15 years and they would always tell me something like this is going to happen and so I, I i have these these capsules of studios in my home <laughs> <laughs> because in the apocalypse, we are still going We're to want still, to hear from Ryan Seacrest. Still going on yes. the air when the world ends. Um, Katie, <laughs> I was very, I, I was, I thought it was very cool that Alexa. I'm going to play this here for a second. That Alexa had so much information about your new album. Katie asked me to let you know that her new album will be released on August 14th. <laughs> Make sure to follow Katy Perry on Amazon Music for more. Katie, uh, you have a very <laughs> close relationship with Alexa because she said she asked you asked her to let us know, which was very casual for her. Well, you know, I just it, it, like we want to we want to keep it adventurous. This whole album launch, of course. So we plant things here and there. That that's been on for a, <laughs> a long time, a, a while, a while, and it took the fans a couple weeks to figure it out. Um, these oh, Easter yeah. eggs, that's what they call them, right? Is yeah. that one of the more fun things to do when you're releasing music? Well, yeah, because, you know, it, it's it, it just like people go on a little bit of a hunt and yeah. you have something to look forward to, but not everything is an Easter egg. So, right. But do you, you know, uh, it is interesting to watch how fans think, some fans think everything is an Easter egg. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some, some flowers are just flowers. Um, Daisies. <laughs> <laughs> Daisies is this uh, new track that's on right now. That's out. And you also, you have a virtual flower shop that you've attached to this release? Yes. I mean, everything is virtual insanity right now. But mm -hmm. um, yeah, we started kind of teasing about it over Mother's Day. And we were thinking about, you know, all the people that usually get flowers from their mom. And it's like, let's set up a virtual flower shop. And there's 12 bouquets on there. And they may or may not have something to do with the songs that are on the record. And, mm -hmm. you know, you see, you'll like, it's almost like you get all of these pieces of the puzzle and then it all starts to come together. It all starts to make I sense. I love that. Love yeah. it. Coming up also on Sunday, it's the Idol finale. We have uh, been doing the show for several months now, the contestants. And I think that the, uh, the talent is just exceptional. Um, you have fostered them throughout with your fellow judges. Are you happy with the way it's turning out so far? Yeah, I mean, what were we gonna? What were you gonna do? Just like give give up on their their lifelong dreams, like four weeks from the finish line? But there were conversations that it may not. It, yes, that that may happen. I mean, they they weren't quite sure if we were gonna pull it off. No, I know, and I mean, I'm glad we did. And I think we could. 
I think we we're, we should be so proud of what our producers put together and our team put together because I definitely think it looks like a notch above everything else. Um, and a lot of hard work has gone into it and it's been a team effort. I know, you know, for myself, like we're usually filming at this point once, maybe twice a week. And, and sometimes we're filming two and three times a week now. And, you know, we're on call. We're on call to make sure that someone gets crowned an American Idol this season, season three on ABC. And like you said, that like, maybe you've heard, oh, the talent's amazing this season, but I, I do feel like our show is becoming an, a place where people are actually trusting it. Legitimate artists, singer, songwriter, kids are using it as an additional platform besides, you know, their own hustle on social media. They're mm -hmm. going, actually, American Idol is putting out legit, artists and it's like it's not a karaoke show mm -hmm. and it's not just noise so mm -hmm. um people are really using it as a launching pad which is really exciting for us yeah and a diverse group of uh finalists coming up uh, real soon you're going to see this on sunday night 8 7 central the finale of the show katie will have a performance of daisies in that show lionel's going to do we are the world uh for the first time on tv in forever uh yes. luke 35 years. 35, yeah, 35 years. Uh, Luke's performing. And then the results will be live. The results, you'll vote during the show, and we'll have those live results from my house uh, at the end of the finale. <laughs> so crazy and, time. And, and this will be one for the history books for Certainly. Idol. I mean, you'll always be able to reference it, right? Absolutely. Yeah. Well, uh, great to see you for a few minutes there from your setup, Katie. Thanks for coming on, and we'll see you Sunday. Yeah. yeah. Sunday, Ryan, and thanks for playing Daisies. You got it. Take care. Bye. Bye. Night. Alexa, where is she going now? <laughs> oh, we didn't plug it in. <laughs>